Hey guys, my name is Debbie and I'm an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you guys your general weekly twin flame energy reading. So hopefully this does help and resonate. We're going to get started here for the Empress entry and energy. Sorry, I can't speak today apparently. Uh, but yeah, and we're going to get started here. I mean, I am using the Marchetti deck. It's a smaller deck. And then for the Emperor energy, again, the Marchetti deck. I feel like that kind of resonates, you know, with, especially at the end when I play matchmaker, matchmaker. If you are interested in your own private reading, all that is in the description box below, uh, as well as I believe it's like 60 bucks uh, to uh, to get one. I would just need the first name of your twin if interested. So let's get into it here. Let's pull some Empress energy in regards to what do you need to know at this time in regards to this twin flame energy. Now, please keep in mind that you are mirroring each other's images. That's what twins do. So they can definitely creep into your sprite as, as vice versa as well. You can creep into there. So I'm already saying that. But there's definitely kind of like a sneak attack in regards to communication by them that is going to be coming on in. For anybody who is uh, asking, they do love you here still. I feel that in regards to your energy, it's kind of like I'm very tossed meaning I don't know what to believe. I don't know, uh, you know, because they don't communicate to me. They haven't opened up to me. There could be ghosting as well with that Queen of Swords looking at that King of Cups energy. There's that energy also of should I just walk away from this? Should I cut them out kind of energy? This is a wish fulfillment for not just them, but as well as you here. They're going to balance out their energy. Now, you do have the power couple of the King, Queen of Pentacles, Earth sign energy that you could be or they are. Uh, does not have to be. That's a balanced couple that can work on things. And I feel that, again, they're sneaking in. So, which is actually better, I feel, because we already know, you know, ourselves what we're going through, you know. But I feel like they're kind of reflecting on why did I walk away? And then I feel also that can we put that work back in? Because maybe they think that maybe you think that you're still mad at them or don't want them back here. But definitely I'm feeling that they want this return as well as you do too. A change here in regards to this. Again, I'm feeling with that page of cups here behind the energy of your empress energy of that queen of pentacles regardless of your sign here you're trying to keep it together trying to stay balanced with this but that tells me that this is going to be kind of like a sneak attack you know out of the blue here especially with the uh eight of wands and the outcome for your energy so prepare yourself you could be uh like me i do this i mentally prepare myself especially when like there was an interview back in the day you know a job interview I would go over in my head, this is what I'm going to say. Of course, it didn't turn out anything like what I prepared myself for. You know, it never does. But definitely, there's going to be this communication to work on this relationship again with the Eight of Wands out of the blue energy of this communication. So you could kind of prep, I feel, in your mind here as to what to expect, how to listen, how to forgive, you know, how that conversation is going to go. You don't want that stalemate energy, you know, like that awkwardness of quiet. So you could be coming up with different topics to bring up, you know, like how you doing, what you've been up to, you know, have you, summertime, have you been traveling, you know, have you gone away for vacation, anything that you can come up with to keep that uh, communication, keep rolling in kind of thing so you can stay away from that. But really talking about this relationship and the progression of it and where it's going to go. So basically what this message is, is that stay balanced, especially with that king and queen of pentacles here. I feel that there's a really quick action here, but there's this toss up between should I stay? Should I go? Should I watch what I say when they do come up? A lot of mental preparing for their return of what you're going to say to them here. Are you going to reject them? Are you going to accept them back kind of thing? The king and the queen of uh, the king of cups here and the queen of swords, she's known as that cutout queen. That's really given me a lot of different messages in regards to I'll communicate, but I want to know the truth. How do you really feel about me here? And I feel that they are going to come clean in regards to I really want to work on this relationship. I've evaluated, I've thought things through. 
you know, I've realized that I have to step up more to the plate here, definitely. But this is communication that I feel is going to be coming in pretty swiftly, definitely. So let's gather your cards and put them to the side. Now we're going to find out what the Emperor energy is all about. Now keep in mind that everybody's different, you know, more clarifiers. I do get into the nitty gritty for more of a private reading than general. Uh, they generally run between like 30 to, I've had it up to 45 minutes long for a video, uh, whatever however long, you know, because there's always some kind of story time usually in a private reading, you know, uh, but it can come out in a general too. So yeah, definitely. I feel that the emperor here uh, has been kind of tossing the idea in their head. They definitely got up in their head here with the two of pentacles looking at that uh, indecisiveness of that devil here. So that's toxicity of the mind. I don't know what to do. I took my time, but really you are their wish fulfillment here for sure. You got matching element of that three of pentacles. Now for some, not all, I feel that they are looking, they are stalking, they are checking out social media. And I always get the comment and I get that because I understand the blocking issue. You know, if there's blocked or vice versa, they can always come up with a different account. Believe me, I have a story of time for that always. Uh, but yeah, so definitely that they're eager to show that action here. There is a chemistry reaction. All right. Got to watch what I say here. Have to be proper. But they are dreaming of you, I feel, as well. Uh, and they're kind of fantasizing. We're going to put that out there, especially with the devil and then the ace of wands. That's fantasizing. Okay. Kind of thinking, you know, how do I approach this? You know, it's been a long time since I've talked to them, talked to you here. But you do have the matching element of the queen of pentacles again. So, and the hermit. So, I feel that they know that you are thinking of them, okay? Oh my God, are you kidding me? And then the King of Pentacles, I even get shocked by messages too. I'm human, I'm normal, you know, as normal as I get. Uh, but you got the power couple again. That is a strong message right there between the two of you. You have matching couple, power couples of the King and Queen of Pentacles for both spreads here. But yeah, they know that you're thinking of them. They too are thinking of you as well. This is so meant to be, so meant to be. I feel like there's a completion in regards to the mental anguish, you know, getting up in their head here with the two fives, five of swords, looking at that five of pentacles. So they've worked on their energy, but two fives equals a 10, which is a completion here. Uh, and they are going to kind of figure things out. They're going to be a little nervous when they return, but there is a decision, but they're kind of prepared for uh, you to be confused um, for uh, you to be frustrated with them. They're hoping not, but uh, but yeah, they're definitely coming out of the blue with the strength card, and they're going to be quite nervous. Uh, back in the day, I can't say recently because I don't date, you know, I don't even talk to dudes, <laughs> but uh, but yeah, it's my choice, but, uh, but yeah, I used to get so nervous, story time, about uh, talking to a guy and my voice would shake. I would lose my breath. Like I couldn't even breathe. I was having like anxiety and oh, it was a hot mess. That's not one of the reasons why I don't date. It's just that, you know, guys can make me nervous. I mean, I'm susceptible to picking up anybody's energy, really. You know, how they're really like, you know, and it, that's a sign. That's a sign you now uh, where I was very, very nervous here. But yeah, I have my own issues, <laughs> you know, too. But I do feel that they are very nervous here. They're going to kind of spontaneous come back here and kind of stir things up with that moon and that tower here. But I feel with the Ten of Pentacles, things will kind of cool. It's uh, like my dad always used to say, cool your horses or uh, yeah, that's it. Uh, but yeah, so that things will kind of cool down, you know, and get bounced again. But yeah, it's that initial shock, I feel. And I feel like it's a tactic of, of theirs, kind of like it's part of the plan. It's kind of like, not only are they going to surprise themselves by how quick action of this communication coming in by them, but it's also going to kind of play a factor with you as well with the shock factor. So, so let's review what we have learned here before we do the matchmaking matchmaking. Very nervous energy, but I feel in the past that they were definitely up in their head. They know that they need to fix things. They are fantasizing about you here 
with their dreams, with their even thoughts. They're not even dreaming. Some of them, they're very good at that. But it's a long time since you've heard from them. They realize this, you know. Uh, but I do feel that it's not just your wish fulfillment. That is amazing how that King and Queen of Pentacles matching couple there came out again. Plus, you got the Queen of Pentacles looking at the Hermit. The Hermit is looking at that King of Pentacles. So they know that you are in their thought, you know, that you are thinking of them here. And it is confirmed by the Sun card, meaning the Yes card, that they too are thinking about them. I also feel that they feel your energy around them as well. But definitely, they want to show that action. They're excited, a little nervous initially, but that will settle. So somebody's definitely going to be shaking some voice, you know, when they return. So let's just gather because I like to play it like a poker game. <laughs> and let's put these bad boys out. Their, their energy, the emperor energy here, like, like a card dealership at a card. Not dealership, Deb. What? All right, let's match the king and queen. Okay, I'm going to bring you down here. All right. All righty. Okay, let's get uh, your cards here. Too many machete decks. Too many piles of it. All right, so now we're going to play matchmaker, matchmaker, um, meaning matching up the cards. Whoops, no. Why did I, why did I, that was weird. Don't mind me. Hmm, that was really weird. My eyes played games with me there for a second. All right. So I feel like I need to collect the fives. I'm going to do that. Is there any other fives here? No, obviously I'm going to collect the aces once I see them. You both have the three of pentacles here. You got the power couple again of the king and queen of pentacles. There we are. That just claims to me that you both are ready right out there. Okay. Queen of swords. I'm not feeling that. King of Cups, you got the Queen or the King, nope, okay, and it's fine, you know, everybody's different with what they get, you both have the Nine of Cups, Oh, you both want each other, that's beautiful, you both are your wish fulfillments here, that's nice, you know, uh, the Knight of Swords here, the Queen of Pentacles, and the Page of Cups, okay, so that's what I have, all right, so let's uh, clean up the rest here, not too, too many, but very powerful messages regardless, Oh, you just have the one ace. That's interesting. So definite energy of stepping forward here for sure. Uh, but yeah. And you got two five. So this is definitely coming to an end. I did feel that. Oh, you got another five. Sorry. Okay. I'm listening while I'm gathering. Okay. Okay. So, wow. Let's uh, let's start off first for the fives, I feel. So, yeah, the five, three fives, you take the three fives, that's, add that together, that's 15. Then you reduce that down to, you do the five and the one for the 15, you got the six. So, the six of uh, swords is moving forward through communication. So, they're definitely communicating, especially with that uh, page of cups. There's an apology owed here, a cup of love being offered here, a change, and that promising, basically, that... Let's take things slow, but really about proclaiming they're going to come back saying, I've worked on my energy. I was confused. I was up in my head, but I worked on my energy with that five of pentacles here. But definitely nice energy. It's that even give and take as well with that six of pentacles added together. But regardless, they're going to show the action here with that ace of wands. Okay, so you two are definitely your wish fulfillments, both of you, because you both want each other here. You both long for each other. You both think about each other as well. And there it is again. The three and the three is the six of pentacles. So there's that even give and take. It's not just one-sided, I feel, okay? So they're definitely thinking about each other. You're definitely going to both work at this relationship again. And you all are ready. I love it. Love it. Love it. So... Both of you know that this is meant to be. Both of you know with that big old pinnacle, okay, that you both are ready for this. This is very positive, very uplifting energy here for sure. But yeah, you both know that you two are meant to be together. They just got in their head basically with that two of pentacles in their spread uh, or whoever spread because they can slip into each other's spreads here. 
But yeah, and uh, looking over at that devil. So that was like an instant, like the one pentacles up, one pentacles down, looking at the devil. It's like, uh-oh, off balance, off balance, up in the head, uh-oh. You know, scare tac tactic here as well. So definitely they're settled, they're ready. This is happening and they're ready to show that action with that ace of wands and cure all. I literally heard and work on things together. Not one-sided anymore. Nobody's ghosting anything anymore, you know, kind of energy here. And that's what I have. Really nice spread, especially with, uh, you know, I don't get shocked a lot, you know, uh, but to have that, as the two couples um, matching each other like that, that's pretty amazing. I, I almost said a curse word. <laughs> I censored myself. Uh, but yeah, so that is pretty amazing. I have to say, like literally amazing. But that's what I have, guys. Again, if you're interested in your own private reading, all that is down in the description box. Um, but yeah, it's not normally 15 minutes, but this is a general. So for something more specific, email me at dubdoesreadings at gmail.com if interested. Thanks, guys. Don't forget to subscribe as well. Smashing that like button, it definitely helps out with my channel. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye.